Hello, this is Brory, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Endless Space 2, playing as the Sofons. Uh, I'm going to confess, it's been a couple weeks since I last recorded an episode. Um, there was a little bit of a gap there, so I apologize for that. But I'm back and uh, trying to remember where we left off. Obviously, we got these uh, couple of behemoths over here, as well as a, a smaller kind of strike fleet. I think this is where most of our landing units are actually coming from. In fact, there are none. On the behemoths themselves, which, you know, makes sense, I guess. Um, oh, you got up to 118,000 health. I guess I still need to get you moved back to get upgraded? Or are you not... Let's see here. You're upgraded. Why do you have so much more health than the other guy does? And more... Yeah, you got more of everything. What did I do different that you're upgraded but you're not... I'm not sure. I'll figure it out later. Um, and we got this smaller fleet, and we got a, a bunch of other guys going on. We got this uh, scientific behemoth over here. We got another one being built over here. And, uh, yeah, we're just going to try and keep working our way through the, uh, the uh, is it Hisho, right? Is that the name of these guys? Uh, it does not say there. I don't see the name of them here either. I think they're Hisho, right? Something like that. Um... So hopefully that'll be, you know, we'll get some good land from them and kind of continue to progress. I did just notice that this, <laughs> this uh, system is almost completely covered up by the uh, the purple guys, which are our allies, to be fair. So maybe the, the rules of influence don't go quite the same way, but I would really like to get the influence back there, uh, to be perfectly honest. So maybe we need to get some influence in this system to kind of help push things out as well. We'll see what we can do there. Uh, as I loaded up the game, I did get this, which is trying to give me a... A truce for some dark glitter. Do I care about a truce with you? Um, you know, I'm just gonna refuse for now. I don't, I don't know if it's anything that we need to worry about right now. I think it was one of our allies that went to war with them, and honestly, I'm not gonna truce them out if they're in a position where they could finish them off. All right, so we did get some more weapons technology, which I think is very helpful. Um. Could get this behemoth stuff here. We could go for some more system stuff. Energy damage, critical hit chance. What's this one? Battlefield archaeology. That's not too bad. It could give us a decent amount of science, to be honest. Just a flat plus 10% and plus 20% per empires at war, which we are currently at war with some people, so well, that one might be kind of interesting. Uh, let's go back to the technology screen so and see what else we can pick up. We've already picked you up, so hopefully we can find some of that resource. And where's the other one? I think we already picked it up as well. Um, where's that one? Where's the other one? Oh, right there. So I think we've already got we've already got both of those techs at the moment. Enhanced behemoths, additional support slots. That would be actually be pretty good. You know, why not? Let's pick that one up. Hostile trace detected. All right, it's fine. Uh, refused a truce. Okay, that's, um, okay, I guess. We have a promotion here. This is our, yeah, this is one of our system guys. Okay, um, some influence. And I was just talking about needing some influence in some places. Um, uh, where are you? You're on Tylus. We'll come back to you for a second. Your Tylus is over here. Actually, some influence here. Would be pretty useful. Yeah, let's pick it up. I like it. Might help push some things out from that perspective as well. Oh yeah, we're getting a big chunk of influence over here now. Hopefully we can do something over here with the against these uh you guys. Even though there are allies, I still don't really like the fact that their influence is encroaching on us. Population gain, construction completed. Uh, everything else looks like it's already set up for something else. You're going back to core science over here, which I suppose is fine for now. And political surveys, etc., etc. All right, so you're coming over this way somewhere. There is a military fleet over here. And we could take them on. Uh, they actually already have a, they have a pretty significant amount of, uh, health over here, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Um, so I think we'll hold off until this other 
uh, behemoth gets there. I assume we're still going to be in control. Looks like we are. Well, these guys are starting to come up a little bit. More troop damage. Actually, wouldn't be too bad for the war that we're in right now. Level 1 cloaked ships can be detected. Oh, that's cool that it shows that. Alright, so that's the behemoth stuff. Uh, you know, I'm just going to wait and pick this one up. I think it's going to be could be useful for us. Alright, Crass. Xeno. What did it say? He got something tourism or something like that. Um, get some more behemoth stuff. We got... Well, we're not really growing. Oh, we're already kept up, so that doesn't matter. Um, can't afford the resource cost. That's fine. This is only going to take one turn. Doesn't really get us anything other than the 10 science per planet, which, you know what? I guess it's probably going to be okay. Can also just follow up with this one, which we don't get the anomaly thing, but at least we get the plus one per person on planet, which, you know, it's a little bit of something. And we are not happy, so... That one does not seem to make much sense. Plus 40% though would be useful, but we'll hold back. Actually, you know what? This one would be pretty good to get us up to potentially happy. Go ahead and plug those three things in and go from there. Teemos. Currently just swamped by the... Oh, we're just... They're actually mutinous right now. Oh, this is... No, this is the new one, isn't it? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the new one. Which hasn't quite come under our control yet. So much food getting lost. I mean, this one doesn't really help us that much. I mean, plus two per person on planets, but the, other, the cold part really doesn't help. More approval would be nice. I guess I'll lock this one in. Maybe we can help start helping a little bit. All right, so fleet number one. It's got a little bit more health at the moment. I want to have you initiate an attack here. I think we'll take the health, the healing. The draw. I mean, we didn't take really much damage, or if we did take any damage, we, we healed it back up. They actually took the repair and recover as well, but we were able to, to knock out two of their uh, ships. I would attack with this other guy, which it might still be okay. Because he's at 57,000. And the other fleet is only at 37,000. So actually, that's probably going to be okay. Yeah, a little bit closer, it looks like. Minor victory took out two ships. Didn't really heal up much, it looks like. Uh, but yeah, it's a start. Cool. I like it. Uh, in turn... How many more turns do we get Teemos completely under control? Probably, what, 10, something like that? We're losing population left and right. I don't see where it says how long it's going to be under, t t until it gets under our control. Uh, refuse to truce. That is fine. I'm glad for that, because I do not want to truce right now. You're continuing to lose population. You are fine. You're doing the magnetic field. Free battle tactics modification available. All right. Um, 50% increase due to morale effect on fleet. More hull plating. More experience. You know, I, actually, I think I'm pretty okay with what we got for now. All righty. Uh, anything else we need to move around or do anything? I think we're okay for the moment. You guys are still kind of doing what you're doing. Um, let's pick the guy with the most health at the moment, which is you. And have you do another attack here. It's actually pretty even. Oh, it's because they grouped up all their guys, which makes sense. 
Minor victory. We only took out one ship. They did turtle on their end. Probably can take our other guy over here. And probably can finish this guy off. Or one of them. Oh, complete complete decimation. And we got a pretty good heal there, so that definitely helps. Uh, more decrease for them. It's kind of probably just going to be the way it is. Uh, I mean, technically that helps your approval a little bit. Fealty Foundation. <laughs> Interesting. Um, I kind of just need more like happiness and things. Microwave pipes. It's a system improvement. Pretty good system improvement, actually, at that. Um, this is only one turn. It would give us a little bit of dust. Can't go wrong with a little bit of dust every once in a while. So let's pick that up maybe for now. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and pick up the food. And I'm probably going to go ahead and grab this thing as well. It's only a couple turns as well. Try to get that system in a good stop, good state. Look, I don't remember how to see where... Until how, how long until it gets under our control? Is it here somewhere? I know it's got to be here somewhere. I'm just oh there it is. System ownership. We're getting plus eight percent every turn, uh, so we need fifty-two percent. So a few more turns. I knew it said it somewhere. I just couldn't remember. Still successfully hacked. Um, one second, show location. Oh, this is from over here. Yes, yes, yes. Um, you can wound their hero, which is interesting. I sure want to. Uh, let's see here. Truce with Gurutsu, which is these guys. No, we, we don't care about that. Tell us what you plan. Are you my fleet guy? You are my fleet guy. Shield absorption on fleet. Um, anything over here that'd be good for the fleet stuff? Energy weapon damage, which is not what we're using right now. Shield capacity. More movement. Honestly, picking up the extra movement wouldn't be too bad. This guy's assigned over here, right? Because that's the only... Oh, no, wait a minute. Where are you? Where are you? Do I have another fleet I forgot about? I must have another fleet I forgot about, don't I? That's what I get for it being so long. Um, okay, we're going to have to find your location, buddy, because I don't remember where you are. Oh, you're over here. That's right. You're You're making your way very slowly back through all this mess. Okay. Okay, that's right. Because you were chasing after pirates or something like that, weren't you? Yes, I remember now. All right, fair enough. You do your thing, buddy. Kind of, maybe the movement will actually help after all. <laughs> I was like, it's going to help a bit, you know, for this fleet over here. Because, you know, it's going to move here in a moment. It's not moving yet. Uh, but obviously, if it's the guy that's out in the middle of nowhere, the, the movement will definitely help. I was wondering why I kept saying that I had fleets that had movement left. I completely forgot about that fleet over there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, hacking operation. Let's go from... I 
focus from here. Oh, that's not what I want. I keep hitting the wrong button. I want to do this from... Can I go from, from this system? Maybe? I don't know. Maybe, maybe that'll go quicker. I feel like the influence is going further and further against us over here. Force just not getting the influence pushback that I was hoping for. Alright, working on microwave pipes, which is good. I mean, that's going to be pretty solid. Right, you're working on a little, little ship getting away from us. We're, uh, we're kind of whittling down the defense little by little. I guess I can move you over here now, probably. I don't know that I need to keep you in the system or not. I honestly don't know if it makes a difference. Alright, so we're getting less from ownership. Nothing here related to uh, keeping the fleets nearby, and I don't think anything here changes. So you know what? Let's just move you over here then. See if we can do a little bit quicker of a, a siege over here. Oh yeah, that's going down to minus 68 now. So that's definitely a bit quicker. I need to get some more assault craft, so to speak. Some more of the, the troop carrying guys. So more science for fertile and cold. Eh, that's a few places that could have that. Permits terraformation into fertile planets. So that might be good too. And you know what? Let's pick it up. I like it. Refuse a truce. Okay, fair enough. Forests. Alrighty, we got a couple colonizable planets still. We're still trying to work on some influence here. This is the one that is currently being swallowed up, so that's really good. More stuff from the strategic resource, which there is at least one. 10% more influence could be useful. We are currently ecstatic. So you know what? Let's plug that one in. And kind of start with that maybe. More per strategic resource. Well, there's only one, but it still would be a decent amount of production. All things, you know, said and done. So why not? Let's pick that one up. It's going to take a while to get it, but more production is always good. I keep saying the population is changing, but it looks like it's staying the same to me. Alright, so you're the guy that just got some extra science there. Alright, we can set the happiness to ecstatic. Or, yeah, ecstatic. So that would could be useful, but I don't think we got to worry about that right now. Uh, more influence, just overall. Kind of like that. Yeah, sure. Let's take more influence. In the opinion of the church. And Tylus finished the scientific behemoth over here. Perfect. Um, what's next? Could go and do the uh, troop carrying kind of transports that I was talking about. Uh, do I have any like better versions of those? Maybe. I think it's called it this lander craft over here. I don't think I've got developed any new ones. So that's crew destruction. I mean, I do have some new weapons, so I could go through all my ships and get some new weapons. I'm not as concerned about this one getting new weapons right away. Um, so I think I'll just maybe build up a bunch of these, though. And send them to the front. So I could probably get... Probably a good four of them here. Like, how many points are you guys each? Actually, you're only one point each. So, we can have several of them in that fleet up front. But, again, I, I probably will want to work on... You know what? Once we take maybe this system or this system gets controlled, and we can send them back over there to get upgraded quicker, instead of having to go all the way back through all this stuff, I will probably go ahead and do an upgrade at that point. Oh, my behemoth. I forgot to move my behemoth.
Uh, this is some of the the black hole stuff. The more tech, the, the better technology cost thing. All right, let's pick that up then. The first to possess fourteen anomalies. Erlov achievement unlocked. You used to want a truce. No, we're not doing the truce, buddy. All right, Hef Reality Institute. This is Ursa. Ecstatic over here, which is really good to see. We do need more influence in places. Uh, actually, this would be a good time for this then. And possibly that's kind of expensive, but the more influence we can get in these areas, the better, I think, right now. All right, Behemoth, you are moving over. I guess you can move over to this one, maybe. Or that one. I don't know if it really matters where we move you. It might even be possible just to leave you right there with the same same one we had before. I don't know. Ten more turns and we'll have the manpower down to zero there, so that might be all right. Endless Secrets, Curiosity, Colonized Desert, Primary Terraforming. We can start doing a lot of a bunch of terraforming stuff at this point. These all like cost nothing to research, which is interesting. Uh, Timos, Finished Microwave Pipes. Oh, that's the new one over here. Okay. The new system we're going after. We're up to 96%. That is good. In fact, we're already content over here. I like to see that. Let's pick up the vision. Sure, whatever. Pick up some of this other stuff. Could be useful. We are level two, so a little bit of dust wouldn't hurt as well. No, I don't want truces. I'm, I'm continuing to work through your systems, guys. Let me do my thing. There goes my behemoth. Uh, this guy's over here. I forgot about you, but you are working through that so we could potentially flip this over somehow why don't you keep doing your thing for now all right more technologies i guess we can keep picking up all these technologies over here i don't know if there's any reason not to Pretty quick. Got a collapsing star. Way over here, because it's nowhere near us. So nothing we're gonna have to worry about. Nope. Keep refusing, buddy. We're not we're not interested. Okay, now we are starting to lose a lot more population in that system. Uh Tylus is working on that. Or Timo is working on that. Tylus just finished four landers real quick. Let's pop you guys out and like have you guys move together. Where are you at? There you are to um, come down here and then come there like come that direction because I don't want I don't know if that ship I mean I don't think it, you know these are guys are strong enough to have kind of held on I guess a single ship but still this will be fine um Tylus, what do we want you to work on now fertile and cold we do have some cold we do have a little bit of fertile so this actually could be useful oh we can start terraforming forest or ocean or things interesting yeah let me think about that i don't know if i want to do it right away but it's definitely something to think about if we have the resource cost we can do a bunch of those types of things we go smasher 150 700 150 so I didn't have more, more people on one of these other ships, did I? No, 750 is the biggest at the moment. All right, we'll start with this and go from there. Uh, and before I forget, I'm kind of getting sucked into this. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and put a cut in here. And when we come back, we should be able to finish off the assault on the soul system. Uh, looks like Timos is finally fully under our control and actually content at the moment, which can't go wrong with that. So we'll, uh, we'll go from there. So I do appreciate you watching, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye.